what happened in the second half you did when you guys were not able to get the resistance that you wanted to out there to stop them a little bit of the defense? Yeah, I th I'm going to say without watching the film, I just thought the game was played at a little bit quicker pace, you know, and I mean, he he found some open areas where maybe in the first half we did a little bit better. Um, again, look, he had 34, he averages almost 32. Like for him tonight, that's that's what he does. He's he's an incredible player and he's, that's, you know, it's going to happen. So to be honest, that wasn't to me a big fact. You know, I mean, he's a big factor in every game. Again, he played a basically the way he plays every night. Um, so I think it was more so, again, right at the basket. You know, we struggled at the rim. He was a big part of it. Brooks, a big part of it where, you know, they finished at the rim and they got a lot higher quality shots at the rim than we did. That was Milton's longest outing since he came back from the injury. Just, he seemed to be a big factor there late. Well, he got going. Yeah, he got going when they kind of took control of the game. That was, he was a big part of that in the pick and rolls, you know, which he kind of turned into some ISOs and stuff. And that's what he does. You know, he's good. Um, that, you know, I, I had watched their last two games, um, but, you know, you could tell they have, you know, watching, they're getting their guys back and they're getting healthier and you can tell that they have an urgency to get going. I mean, I saw that in both the Indiana game and the New Orleans game. And, uh, you know, they'll obviously they'll be right there. You know, they certainly have a, have a good chance to make a long run. Good. Thank you.